Welcome Librans. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is the full moon of April 26th and the energy of this full moon is the pink full moon. All right, ladies and gentlemen, some people want to see me laying out the card. I will be back on camera um, soon, but um, for this full moon, we're going to be doing it like this. So remember to like and share these videos and go and check out your Taurus season. The Taurus season is the house of the second house. It is your financial flow house. Go check out the Taurus season for you, Libran. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's check out deceptiveness. Okay, deceptiveness. So be aware of what is happening in the first week of this full moon, but they found out, okay, this is uh, the Wheel of Fortune. Some deceptiveness that has transpired in the past, they're now recognizing the foul play. So Librans, be aware of this. Second week, they recognize that an Aries, the or fire sign person, have created some sort of a deceptiveness, okay? And it has to do um, with a family. So it's as if... Um, this Aries Leo or a fire sign person and their family have created some sort of a deceptive play. Because if you notice, this is how deceptiveness that has um, um, created in the past, it have to do with an Aries Leo or a fire sign person and their families, okay? And this could be your child that have created a whole other issue for the family. Here it is that they recognize that a situation at the workplace, a lot of you liberals are going to be finding out what a young Aries Leo or fire sign person have done at the workplace. Truth is going to be coming out. They're going to be coming down on this person. Um, the Knight of Swords is the energy of someone investigating this person and their family, and they're going to be coming down on this person. There's, there's information. Whenever the Knight of Swords and you recognize whoever this person is, they recognize uh, that in the past, this Aries Leo or Sagittarius, is, it, it could be coming up as an Aries Leo or Sagittarian person has done something and they're now finding out what this person have done. And they now recognize that some sort of a deceptiveness that was created by a family and a family business and it has to do with an Aries Leo or fire sign person. Then we see a lot of you, the Six of Cups, this could have been... Uh, a co-worker or someone that you were dealing with at the workplace or um, someone who was a customer service to you that has uh, um, created some sort of a dismayal. An end is going to be coming up for this Aries, the fire sign person. Some of you are going to be firing this person because you recognize what they have done. An end is also going to be a six of cups. A lot of you are going to be recognizing what a Pisces, what a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn man have done. They're now going to be recognizing um, the dishonesty of a Virgo um, businessman or a Virgo man. They're coming down on a Virgo man because they recognize that a Virgo man is connected to um, a, a fire sign person. Um, whoever this person is, was it that this person worked for this Virgo man? Um, they now recognize the connection between this person and a Virgo man, and they're going to be coming down on this Virgo um, um, businessman or this Virgo man um, because they recognize that this Virgo man is connected to this uh, um, Aries Lee or fire sign person, okay? So um, a lot of you, this Aries Lee or fire sign person could be someone at uh, the workplace, Okay, this Aries the Pisces sign person could be a family member. And uh, whoever this family member is, people are now recognizing what this young person have done. So it, it could be also someone who had access to your data and information, a customer service person. And they're now recognizing what this person have done. So a lot of you, they're going to be recognizing um, that uh, there is a huge deceptiveness that has uh, uh, transpired in the past so where whoever this, whoever this person is, an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person, this person is not older than 50. This person is younger than 50. In the past, they and their family have created uh, some criminal offense, okay, and some sort of a deceptive situation, and we are going to be finding out what this person have done, because their family is in the reverse, and 
what you're recognizing is that uh, they're investigating the connection between this Aries Leo fire sign person and this Virgo man because they're now recognized and it's going to be finding out the connection. And this energy of the Six of Cups is a, a situation where some of you Libran is aware of who this Virgo man is or who the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is because it's a businessman. It's a businessman or a supervisor. And they're going to, the Knight of Swords is going to be investigating this um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn um, business and connection to work because this person had given this young lady some sort of a data and documentation and this person, this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man is a friend of a, a you Libran. Is it your, because this is an older man, is it your son? Is it your husband? Who is this man? So Librans, you're in for some sort of a wake up call um, that is going to be coming up, some sort of a wake up call. And you know, you Librans, you're very sensitive because you take things personally, but Librans, full moon readings and my readings, I go straight to the point. I have no time to tell you um, that, hey, you know, there's a new house that you're walking to because that is BS, okay? I'm sorry, Librans. Um, you know, you guys like just, um, you know, right straight up. I don't have any time because not everybody's going to be walking and thinking about uh, a new house because that's just BS, okay? Because I don't, I cannot give people BS because I channel, okay? And the stories is here with each and every card and what, what come before and after. It is the story that has been told. So I'm not going to be telling you, oh, you know, um, you're looking forward to go to a new house and you're going to build it because it is BS. And I do love you, Librans. But sometimes I think that my readings are too heavy for you, Librans. But if you look at what transpires in your world, you're going to be recognizing that I just give it, I just cut it straight how it is, okay? The Wheel of Fortune is here, and the Wheel of Fortune has something to do with a young lady, an Aries the Earth Sagittarian person. Um, whoever this Aries the Earth Sagittarian person is, they're going to be finding out some sort of a deceptiveness with this person and their family in the past. This person could be a friend and is connected. They're also going to be finding out something about this person. If this Aries the Earth Sagittarian person is your friend, they're going to be finding out something about this friend and their business, okay? So be aware of this. In the past, the Wheel of Fortune comes back to tell of something that happens in the past, some sort of a deceptiveness um, um, that has transpired with a family. And they are now investigating a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person, okay? All right, so let's see what you're coming in with. Yes, so uh, the Two of Cups. This is definitely family uh, situation, family relationship, relationship situation where there was some cheating and some sort of a deceptiveness. Um, it is a friendship situation where you're finding out that a friend and their family or a friend has cheated someone in the past. Um, that sort of a situation is coming out. But um, this is a situation where it could be sisters and brothers, uh, um, it could be a situation where it's friends, good friends who have um, a friend of yours who have cheated or did something in the past and it's coming back and you're going to be finding out about it. Then we see the energy of the devil. The energy of the devil. So you're ending this with the energy of the devil and the energy of the devil has to do with friends. Whoever this friend is and whoever this person is, is a friend of yours and is a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn man. And this person carried the energy of the devil, okay? And, you know, what is transpiring is that they're going to be recognizing what this person have done. They're definitely going to be finding out what the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man has done. And I see a lot of you are going to be surprised at who this person is and what this person have done. And people are going to be really coming down on this person because they're going to be finding out the truth of this person. And a lot of you are going to be very surprised at what this person have done. So truths are going to be revealed and they're going to be recognizing that a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man and their friends have, has created a really 
negative situation, okay? Because this is about negative influence that is affecting some of you Librans and it's have to do with a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn um, man and his friends or a, a, a Virgo man. And this Virgo man um, use um, negativity in order to control some sort of a situation. And this is an older a businessman. Um, and I, this, this, oh, this man work with, um, witchcraft, witchcraft, voodoo, um, name the shit. He works with it. That is how his business run. Okay. So you Librans are going to be finding out about this. So I see desperation, desperation, desperation is coming up. A whole lot of desperation is coming up. Um, Desperation, a couple is now desperate because they recognize that a couple is connected um, with some sort of an unfair um, game in the past. They are now recognizing who this couple is and that this couple has created some sort of an unfair game. Um, a couple is now desperate because they're now get, um, coming on to this couple and recognizing. So it could be another couple. It doesn't have to be you, Librans. It could be another couple who is now desperate because they're finding out something. It could be your sister or brother that is now desperate. You and your sister or brother got did something. Desperation because they're now putting the puzzle, putting the pieces together. It could be you and your partner that did something and they're now putting the pieces together. In the second week... Again, um, uh, it's coming up. I said to you guys that this Aries Leo Sagittarian could be um, a family member or it could be your child uh, or it could be a friend. Okay, so uh, it could be a family member that is your good friend. They're going to be recognizing what this family member has done and their family. Okay, it could be your friend and they're going to be recognizing what this uh, um, young um Aries Lee or Sagittarian has done together with their family. So some of you is your friend. Some of you is a family member. It depends on who you are. And we are going to be looking at that. Then when we look at the third week, the third week is that they're going to be investigating. Um, you Librans, they're going to be investigating um, you Librans and some sort of a situation with a business overseas. They're going to be recognizing that you Libran. It's not your business. However, you Librans, you Librans could have created some sort of a situation and illusion saying that you have a business overseas and they recognize it is not your business. They are now recognizing and seeing the truth and they're now investigating a lot of you Librans and they now recognize that the business is not yours. So I see truth is going to be coming out and people are going to be recognizing what is going on. I see in the last week, a lot of you uh, Librans are worried, worried um, about um, some of you men are worried about your business and a business partner, um, which is your friend, which is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. A lot of you are worried about this person or this person is worried. Maybe this person is your husband, a family member, or your boss is worried and this person recognizes uh, that a whole lot of problems is coming up. So some of you Librans, uh, this person could be... Uh, um, a partner, an ex-partner, an ex-business partner, whatever is transpiring. But I see negative forces, the energy of the devil. And whoever this person is, is using negative forces to uh, manipulate a situation. Um, and you, uh, Librans, could be using negative forces to manipulate a situation, but it's not going to be happening because they're not recognizing um, the play of what was happening and transpiring. So, you know, it is a serious, serious case what is going on because I see desperation and a whole lot of you Librans are desperate and a whole lot of you Librans very desperate because of some sort of a deceptiveness. And at the workplace, a lot of you Librans are worried about your work, your job, your position. At the workplace, a whole lot of you are worried about your business. Um, a whole lot of you, you know, are thinking to go to another city or thinking to relocate, that is coming up also. And especially your young Libran ladies, uh, there is some sort of a problem with you at the workplace uh, for some of your young Libran ladies. And I see that they're now recognizing the connection between you Librans and a Taurus Virgo, um, Taurus Virgo Capricorn man. And they recognize that you Librans uh, could be connected with this man. And this man is, is, is in another place. Uh, 
And this man is the man that used negative forces to control people and situation. There is the energy of the devil and it's connected to a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn man and a group of friends. And now you Librans are now recognizing that uh, some sort of uh, negative forces where the connection of a group of people and a uh, Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn man is the biggest player in this situation. Mm. So whoever this person is and however this person is affecting your life, Librans, um, you know, there is really this person is is using negative forces. This is really because this deck is for full moon and this deck is about witchcraft, negative forces, um, you know, um, um, spells, whoever. And this person is a big player. He and his friends is a big player. And you, Libran, could be aware of that or is being controlled by this person. All right, let's look at the sun sign people. So sun sign people are people who were born 6 a.m. to 6 p.m., Let's look and see what is coming up. So we see lies and deceptiveness. A whole lot of lies. And uh, it could be that you Librans together with your partner have created a whole lot of lies. Okay. Or your partner. But you're going to be recognizing. Um, and that is giving you some sort of a desperate uh, situation because you recognize that some sort of information that your partner told you is not true. Okay, so it could be your partner has cheated on you or your partner had lied to you because obviously um, this is someone that is in a relationship and their partner, you're desperate now because you recognize that your partner never told you the truth and you're now desperate. Yes, and... Um, they now recognize that some of you Librans, you're desperate because your partner never told you the truth and something was stolen from a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman. And they, this woman is now standing up and showing up that you Librans have something to do with it. And you Librans are now recognizing Jesus. My partner didn't um, tell me the truth about this, uh, you know, the, his family or his parents or his mother. You know, my partner, give me some sort of a story. And now um, you're recognizing that your partner did not speak the truth. So here is it where a lot of Librans, uh, you recognize that uh, the mother of your partner has spoken up and show up that there was some sort of a um, play. And you are recognizing my partner did not speak the truth. And here you are being very desperate because uh, they now recognize that you Librans, uh, a Taurus Virgo a Capricorn person, recognized that there was some sort of a deceptiveness in the past and recognizing that you Librans had lied. And they showed up and it's as if you Libran has not spoken the truth. And a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn woman is showing up that you have created some sort of a deceptiveness and a whole lot of lies between you Librans and your partner. And I see you, you Librans are now desperate because this woman is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is showing up that you lied and you created a theft because you have stolen uh, some sort of an information for a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person. This is your mother's partner. And they now recognize that you Libran had lied. And now you Librans are desperate. And you're trying to throw the situation off on your partner. But people are aware that you program and uh, choose your partner because you recognize that your partner or someone someone send you to target your partner okay because they know the that the, the mother of the partner is an i class person you stole the woman information there the mother of your partner you stole the mother's information the mother is a taurus virgo or a capricorn person and now you're desperate because if they're coming in on you and they know, they have known for a long time what you have done. Then they're recognizing that a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person and whoever this Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person is, they recognize that 
an Aries dear or a Sagittarian person, I've got some sort of a details and information and is a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion person who gave this person the information. It is not showing up who it is, but it's an older man who gave a Taurus, Virgo, or Capric uh, an Aries Leo, or Sagittarian young lady some sort of a data and information. And they're now recognizing and, and seeing the truth because they recognize that you guys not only um, took details of this woman, but also of this woman um, partner. Okay? And they're now recognizing and seeing the foul play. A lot of you who have a friend that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarian, this friend is younger than you are. Um, it is coming up as a friend for you, Sun Sign people. They're recognizing that this friend have an older Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person that has been financial supporting them. You're going to be finding out who this Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person is. I see heartbreaks. Heartbreaks is coming up for a lot of you, Libran, um, at the workplace. Um, some sort of a news is going to be coming up. Heartbreaks is coming up for a whole lot of you at the workplace. Whatever the issue and the problem is, and it's going to be affect a lot of you, Librans, at the workplace, there are some sort of a heartbreaking situation, some sort of an emotional um, problems that is transpiring. Um, a lot of you, Librans, is going to be recognizing that an Aries, Leo, or Fire sign person work you out. Or a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion person worked you out, but heartbreaks is coming up at the workplace for you, Librans. Um, some sort of a situation is going to be transpiring. I don't see an ending, but I see heartbreaks. Okay, in the fourth week, I see light is going to be shedding on a situation. Light is going to be shedding on a group of friends that you, Librans, have. They're going to be investigating. A group of friends that you Librans have. Light is going to be shedded on a group of friends that you Libran have. And this could be what is affecting you. And what is going to be showing up and affecting you is that they're going to be finding out truths about your co-workers or your friends. But it's more as a, um, a lot of you Librans are going to be recognizing that your friends and finding out some sort of information about your friends. Okay, there. And... Uh, um, if some of you have a scorpion that is a friend of yours, you're going to be finding out some sort of an information because they're going to be recognizing what has been happening and transpiring. So it is a situation, um, they're liberals, um, about some sort of a deceptiveness where there could be, have been some cheating in a relationship. There has been lies that was told. Um, and it is all coming out. And I see that a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person recognized the foul play that was happening and transpiring and the, the information, the lies and, 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 cause this is 10 of swords. And a lot of you Librans are going to be recognizing that either your partner or a cancer person have stabbed you in the back. Okay. And then we are looking at the situation and a lot of you, they're going to be recognizing, um, 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 a lot of you, something about your mom and your father. If your mother is a Taurus Virgo Capricorn and your father is a Pisces Cancer Scorpion, I see heartbreak for this man. Whoever this man is, this Pisces Cancer Scorpion person, heartbreak is coming up for this man because the truth is going to be coming out. So if your child's, um, uh, if your friend or you're going to be finding out something that a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion person, um, have created some sort of an issue that your daughter had an older man, um, an older man. So your daughter is a young person who had an older man as a friend. And I see whoever this older man is was financial supporting your 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 friend or your daughter this is a young woman but i see heartbreaks is coming up for this man because they're going to be recognizing what this man have done light and truth is going to be coming out about this man so i see heartbreaks for this man because they're going to be recognizing the play of this man and some sort of a situation at the workplace where heartbreaks is coming up for this man so if you are in a relationship with a pisces cancer or scorpion person that is your child father um, 
you are going to be recognizing this. If you're in a relationship with a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion man, this man is seeing a younger person and I see you're going to be finding out, okay? So um, this man is seeing an Aries there or a Sagittarius and you're going to be finding this out. So um, it is a younger person. Um, then we see heartbreaks is coming up at a workplace and I see light is going to be shedding on your friends. So sun sign people in the four weeks, some sort of information is going to be coming out about your friends. And this is going to be a situation where people are going to be recognizing um, what has been happening and transpiring. And this is going to be good. Alrighty, let's go to the moon sign. Alrighty, so um moon sign people, people that was born 6 a 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. Um, we see that you're going to be successfully overcoming a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man. This Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man, together with a cancer, was creating some sort of illusion. Um, this is that the um a cancer together with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man um used negative forces to control a situation. It didn't work. It did not work. So it's as if whoever this cancer is, because a lot of you Librans are dealing with a cancer, and whoever this cancer is, try to work together with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man to control a situation. And I see you Librans are going to be successfully overcoming these two people because people now will recognize what was happening, what was transpiring, and how um, people were creating a whole lot of illusions and um, situation that was transpiring around you. So this is good. Then we look and I see the two of ones and I see um, that a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man is going to be um, either asking you Librans uh, or uh, offering you Librans some sort of an offer. Okay. And the thing about it is that uh, light has been shed and it's as if uh, um, this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is going to be offering you Libran some sort of a offer. Okay, so expect some sort of an offer to come from this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man. But, you know, whatever the offer is coming in, it's up to you Librans because I can't really tell you um, if you should take this offer because this person is using negative forces to manipulate situations. So, it's not for me to tell you to take the offer or not. I wouldn't, okay? Because I don't deal with people who use negative forces, but for each its own. So I wouldn't take that offer. Now, in the second week, I see they recognize and find out a whole lot of information about a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person. Whoever the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person is, they are now putting the pieces together and trying to recognize who this person is and what was transpiring. Some of you, this could have been your mom and some sort of information could be coming out about your mom. Or this could be that a lot of you Libras tried to say that a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person is your mother. They know it's not your mother and it's not true. Let it go. You, this is not your mom. Okay, so... Um, the information is going to be coming out that is not true. A Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person is not your mother. Then we see the Two of Swords. So a whole lot of information. Um, light is now being shed in on a family. So you Librans, whatever that was transpiring, a friend of the family is recognizing the truth and recognizing that, that your mother is not a Pisces. Your mother is not a Pisces. And also who you're pretending to be, uh, you are not the person, okay? Um, you have used someone else's data and information and your mom is not the Pisces. And people are now, a friend is saying, no, 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 that is not her mother. Um, and the, the friend is showing up and say, and showing and say, no, that's not the Libran mother. That, that's not her mom. Okay, so people are now recognizing and seeing the truth of a family. And I see you Libran, so it's as if a family you, your family, some sort of a secret, some something about your family is going to be coming out or something that was happening in your family is going to be coming out, okay? Then we see um, the energy of transition because they recognize something. So transition, they're going to be recognizing um, that some of you Librans try, um, there is some sort of a 
karma um, about your family and they're going to be recognized that in your family in um, the family of you Librans there was a whole lot of lies so um, you see the ten of stored um, and a cancer stab you Librans in the back okay you a cancer in the past I stab you Librans in the back by using you Librans to affect a family and um, create some sort of issues. And I see you Librans are going to be giving up a cancer and said, listen, this person contact me and ask me um, to target um, this guy. And I didn't know anything about these people. The cancer is the one who called me up and asked me to do this. And I see it's a situation where you Librans are going to be recognized. And these people haven't done um, the cancer anything. The cancer is a liar. The cancer is the one who called me up and asked me to um, connect with this family. I didn't know this family. And I see that that is the only way that some of you Librans are going to be getting out of a, a situation because um, you Librans, they throw you Librans under the bus and you Librans have to stand your grounds because especially people that was born 6 p.m. to 6, 6 p.m. to 6 a.m., um, I see that a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn is going to be asking you to do something. And this person have asked you to do something in the past against a family. And they're now recognizing um, because you Librans has said something. Now, if your mother is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person, I see something about you Librans. They're going to be recognizing, no, that is not the person. That is not um, your mother. And they're going to be looking back at information and recognizing and looking at information between you and your mother and recognizing that person is not your mother. I don't know. It could be you Librans looking at someone and is recognizing or you Librans who was um, assessing a situation. But I see you Librans wish you did not um, connect it and did something because uh, they're not recognizing the truth. Um, they're going to be a friend is going to be seeing the truth about your family liberals. Um Something about your family is going to or a family friend is going to be coming out. They're going to be recognizing this. So something some information about a family friend is going to be telling you Libran something or some information about a family friend is going to be coming out. So here the energy of the wheel of fortune with a family. They recognize that you Libran have really. Um, target it a family and for whatever the reason is and however this comes up maybe you Libra and your family was targeted or you have targeted a family vice versa however this is coming up they're going to be recognizing and seeing the truth and recognizing what has been happening and transpiring and I see um, they're going to be recognizing the truth and the play of what was transpiring wow liberals it is a powerful full moon i wish you guys love please like share this reading and i will speak to you next time namaste